In just a matter of weeks, the streets and sidewalks here in downtown Stroudsburg will be filled with happy parade goers for the borough's 45th annual St. Patrick's Day Parade. Rachel Metzger and her family attend the parade every year, but she says sometimes the meeting of the holiday gets lost. Usually people think that it's a day of getting drunk and overindulging in alcohol and that Irish culture an Irish American culture has become synonymous with getting drunk yeah. and uh, it's all Guinness and whiskey and that's all there is and nothing more. So this year she and her sister took it upon themselves to give people another option instead of hitting the bars after the parade. The first annual sober St. Patrick's Day is coming to Stroudsburg as an alternative for people that don't want to drink or be in a situation where there are people drinking after the parade where we're going to have Irish music. We'll have three Irish bands and there'll be dancers and a corned beef and cabbage buffet. Sober St. Patrick's Day started in 2011 in New York City as a way to celebrate Irish and Irish American culture without alcohol in a fun, safe and sober family friendly environment. I hope that they take away that there's so much more to St. Patrick's Day and Irish culture than just getting drunk mm -hmm. and that you can come and have a good time with your family and you can come if you're in recovery yeah. and it's for everyone to enjoy. The event runs from four in the afternoon until eight in the evening on March 24th at the Stroudsmore Country Inn. Tickets are $60 for adults and $45 for children 10 and under. We have ticket information on WNEP.com. I'm Andy Eustis, Newswatch 16, Monroe County. Don't forget, Pittston St. Patrick's Parade is tomorrow. The fun starts with the Leprechaun Loop Run and Fun Walk at 1030. The parade travels on Main Street and loops onto Kennedy Boulevard. The 11th Annual St. Patrick's Parade steps off at 1130.